My uncle's name is James. He was born in a small town in England in 1965. He grew up in a close-knit family, and he had two siblings, an older sister and a younger brother. As a child, James was always curious and loved to explore the countryside near his home. He spent his summers climbing trees, fishing in the nearby river, and collecting insects. His parents encouraged his love for nature and learning. When he was a teenager, James developed a passion for music. He learned to play the guitar and joined a local band. They played at small gigs in their town and had a lot of fun. This was the beginning of his lifelong love for music. After finishing high school, James decided to pursue a career in music. He moved to London, which was a big step for him. He worked part-time jobs to support himself while he continued to play in different bands. It wasn't easy, but he was determined to make a name for himself in the music industry. In his late 20s, James met his future wife, Sarah, at a music festival. They shared a deep love for music, and their relationship blossomed quickly. They got married and had two children, a son and a daughter. James eventually achieved some success as a musician, and his band released a few albums that gained popularity. He also started teaching guitar lessons to local children, passing on his knowledge and love for music. As the years passed, James and Sarah enjoyed a happy family life. They often took their kids on outdoor adventures, exploring the same countryside that James loved as a child. His children, inspired by their father, also developed a passion for music. Now, in his 50s, James looks back on his life with satisfaction. He has a loving family, a successful career in music, and countless cherished memories of his adventures and experiences. Learning English through stories like this can help you improve your language skills, expand your vocabulary, and gain a better understanding of narrative structures. You can ask questions or request more specific information about any part of the story to practice various aspects of the language.